Oh god! Oh, too heavy! It's hard to breathe in that thing. What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? Neil Beowulf and Squish here. And we are gonna get our crap together. And we're gonna play some Vulcanoid. That's right, we're gonna play some Vulcanoids. Because it looks pretty freaking cool. Let's get this stream shiggity 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 shared out, and then we will rock with it. Look at nuts. Hey yo, squishy peoples. We're now with a super special treat. I said, okay, nuts. You know what? Let's add them too, just in case they care. Hi Squishy. Alright, that is shared. It's tweeted. It's tweeted. It's tweeted. Um, this game is too loud for my ears. Let me turn that down a hair. How's the volume for you guys? Is it good? Is it exceptional? Get that tail. Oh, get that nose. Squish. The cat that's terrified of plastic bags does not care about grips. Whatever. Whatever. Let's do this. Yes, so today, my dear squishy people, we're going to play some Vulcanoids. I saw C4 tweeting about this game and it looks pretty interesting. So we're gonna give her a go. Drano's used to be a wondrous place, a rich and prosperous island, home to a busy trading port. But that was not meant to last. It began when strange formations like the giant soil tracks started to appear across the island. No one was able to explain how they were made. Soon after the formations appeared, Earthquakes followed. Weak at first, they grew more frequent and more violent. <clears throat> I clicked on it and it skipped it. Oops. <laughs> Crap. Hi, Kyle. Oh, welcome to the stream, sir. Welcome to the stream, Kyle. Yeah, I have never played this game before. So we're going to see what we got. It's supposedly survival steampunkish stuff. So we're going to she. Four out of eight. Well, okay, that's module repair kit. Combined with build tool to repair any damaged device or module. Okay. Let's see. What do we got here? I. Okay. Inventory. Upgrades. Online. Upgrades. Talk to the captain. We got a nice World of Warcrafty type quest log. Cool, cool, cool. What a refinery station. Ooh. I do. Oh, menu. Copper and sulfur. Module not available. Okay, okay, okay. We have lots of storage things. Med kits. Okay. So, here's we got a shotgun and some slugs. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that, I think. Not sure what everything is. See another production station, but I don't know how to use it. Storage. Okay, seems like a good thing to know where it's at. And just an empty room. What is this? Doesn't do anything. Another storage. What do we just do? I don't know what that did. If the game goes too long without music, 
Uh, whatever it's doing, it is burning energy. Wait, 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 wait. Did we just... What is this? Turn off. Huh. I don't know what that is. Load, save, go up, down, travel. Ooh, looks pretty cool. What do we got over here? No idea, no idea. Oh, big old map. Granite, refinery tech, production. Okay, we're just we're absorbing how to, the initials, you know? All right, Captain Steubing, what we got? Craft drill ship core. Good day, Shayla. Before we can continue with the expedition, you will have to construct a device. A device, okay. Follow the given objectives, and you will soon be piloting your own drill ship. Get a ship core upgrade to play inventory. Sure, I will take that quest. Why not? See, if you look at the very top, it says volcano eruption in seven minutes and some odd seconds. Is this our way out? Oh, it is. Well, it looks... Hey, it looks pretty cool. It seems to be running smooth. So already it's got two things, or at least one thing up on arc, right? Ah. That's good. That's good, perhaps you go. Let's see, press two to equip a pickaxe. Okay, we got a pickaxe. Bit of a slow pickaxe. That's okay. If you've, ever, if you've ever swung an actual pickaxe, it is a bit on the slow side, so. Going for realism here. Copper scrap metal. Can I go in these places? Are you telling me I can't climb that ramp? Oh, come on now. Hmm. I hope at some point, maybe it's just that one. No, I guess we can't go in the houses at all. So I hope at some point, not only can we go in the houses, but I hope we can destroy them too. <laughs> because that's how we roll. If this game goes too long without music, I do have the I do have iTunes up, so we can crank up the playlist. Hey, it's pretty. I would totally dig living here. For sure. Until you know all kinds of crazy shit starts to happen. So what do you okay? Oh, we equip our pickaxe. And it actually shows us the nodes. Okay, cool. So we need 20 coal and 20 copper. What do we do with these? Okay. We nailed it and we got auto saved. Hi, Squish. What's up with you, Plonkins? What up? How you doing? Give me all them squishy nuzzles. Okay, we do have a stamina bar there on the other s that that side hmm, to build exactly a device. No, no device in particular. It's just go build yourself a device. Well, that was twenty copper. Nice, pretty easy. Since we're here and we're getting ore, I figure it would probably be a good idea to have extra, right? We can all agree on that. I don't see a durability indicator for my pickaxe, which I'm okay with, because I have to make repair and fix tools and all that crap, so that works for me. It's a very peaceful island, that's for sure. Cool. Master got me mining, mining's never finished. Someday Squishy let me go home. I wonder if we're a coal miner's daughter. Eh. You know, it just seems like it would be prudent to go to the options. And I, let's see, key bindings, key bindings. Show hide. Video? 
Cardboard buildings suck. <laughs> yeah, they do. Well, again, this, this game, I think, is pre-alpha. So, you know, it's, it's got a long road ahead of it. But, you know, for pre-alpha, I think it looks pretty freaking good. Okay, I didn't see anything about key bindings. Interesting. Okay, so I is inventory, fortunately. We got that one down. Let's see what our other buttons do. T. High squish. A and D go side to side. J is our journal. Good to know. K, L. L is also the journal. Good. M for map. I like it. What about some F's here? F1 goes to help. Okay, cool. So space jump, quick load, quick save. Tool, wrench, pickaxe, shotgun, rotate, rotate building. Interesting. YouTube video tutorial. Yeah, we're not gonna watch that on stream. When time is getting close to zero and sirens go off, you hit the go down lever to go directly underground to hide from eruptions. All right. Well, we've got three minutes till this <laughs> till this erupts, so we might want to keep an eye on that. <laughs> Definitely keep an eye on that. We're not going back till we have a sufficient amount of coal. Achievement progress. Robot destroyer. You guys can't see it. I'm blocking it. Robot destroyer. Eight out of ten. I. I haven't destroyed any robots. You know what? We got two minutes till this volcano erupts. Just for safety's sake. Maybe we should go home. It's rumbling. Y'all hear that? I felt a low rumble in my loin squish. And it was the volcano. And then we have this copper scrap metal stuff. I, don't, I say I don't know what it does, but I don't know what any of this stuff. Is there fall damage? I don't know. <laughs> That's kind of a kind of a puny jump button, isn't it? Oh, it's even telling us hide from eruption. That's what I tell all the ladies. Oh, baby, you better hide from this eruption. Ow! I just shut that on my head. Oh, wait. Quick, run into the submarine. The volcano will erupt soon. Go, go down, man. Use periscope to see what is happening on surface. Um, down periscope. Maybe I should put this away. Maybe that's why I can't use this. Okay, I... Oh, okay, it's got it. That's the periscope. Why is, why is my periscope so far away from the submarine? Huh. It's not erupting for another freaking minute. Okay. Uh, deploy storage module. Go to storage module. Storage module. Wait, what about workbench? Consumables. Tools. <gasps> Grenades. Nice. All kinds of cool stuff. Structures. Fascinating. Storage. Object. What are we? What are we doing here? Core. Oh, we gotta get back to the periscope. I see what's going on. I better see like death raining from above. Oh, come on, squish. Hold me close. Hold me closer cause I wanna get squishy and squishy. It's gonna erupt squish. Oh shiz. And if that was atomic, we'd be playing Fallout after this. Cue the Fallout music. Blah, blah, blah. Eruption is over. It is safe to go out. 
continue with your agenda. Oh dear. Well, I mean, this once, this once great land is now ashen. Doesn't that suck? Okay, deploy storage model. Go to the storage module. Okay, and click it. What am I doing with it? Upgrades. Drillship core. How do we make our device? Upgrades. Oh yeah. Um, I don't know. Saturn volume. I squish. I squish. You know what? Show me, show me my quest, damn it. Get ship core upgrade. Craft core. Upgrades. Craft core. Okay, this is a core. How do I... How do I do whatever it is I need to do with this core? Production station. Can we product something? Upgrade. Drill ship segment, drill ship core. Module not available. Why not? Component. What does it say what I need to be able to make it? Tool, ammo, module, wait, module. Storage, okay, go to storage module. Deploy a storage module. Module not available. Why? Equipment. Structure. I'm a little bit at a loss here what I want to do. Or what I need to do, I should say. Maybe it's this button? Deploy storage module? Okay. Copper to storage. Click the coal to storage. Okay. There, have, have some of both of this. Here, have all of it. We want to take that too? Okay, quest window. Well, that's what I needed to do. Is that crafting a core? What is, what is that doing? What are these icons over here? Okay, go to power module on ceiling. Deploy power module. Okay, deploy refinery module. Okay. Done, done, and McDunn. Refine copper. Okay, so I need to get this stuff, what, out of storage? Oh, it wants me to put that stuff back. Is it already crafting that stuff? I don't... Give me this, and give me this. Okay. Refined copper. Copper ingot. See, I don't see anything that tells me what it takes to craft it. In Q, storage. Okay, so we got 20, 20, 20. No, wait, we're making copper ingots. Um, These menus, these menus are slightly confusing. I'm not entirely sure what we're looking at. Character. Okay, so we got 20 coppers and 20 coppers. We gotta make 16 ingots. Where is it pulling these from? Okay, so it's pulling them from the storage. Can we just... Oh, we can. Okay. Yeah, it, it's... I think it will take a little bit of learning, but, you know. And it looks like it sends them direct to storage. Okay, deploy production module. Just over here. Let's deploy that production model. Oh, yeah. 
produce copper plates. Okay, so these are linked. So essentially it looks like we're powering things and then using them. Produce copper bolts, tubes, and plates. So component. All right, we need three bolts, three tubes, and six plates. That should all be, yep, that's all going to storage. Okay, getting the hang of it slowly but surely. <clears throat> you know, let's play some tunes. Let's see, let's find a good one. Here we go. Wait, what happened to my copper tubes? I needed more. Wait, where's just... Um, two more tubes. Okay. Oh, jeez. Our freaking... All this to craft a core? I don't... All right. Produce ship core. Produce breach replacement. Produce production module T1. Produce a refinery and produce a door. Oh, my God. Okay, click the menu button on the production station. We're there. Select upgrades. Produce ship core T1. Okay, that's producing. Uh, okay, so it does tell you what it requires. It looks like it takes two copper ingots. So online cargo items, two copper ingots. And this takes a plate, a tube, and a bolt. Okay. So the ship core is good. A breach replacement. Consumables. And we need three of those. Yeah, squishy, squish. Squish them like We gotta produce a production module. Select modules. And we need a storage. Production, production tier one, crafting, and we need a refinery module. Done, done, and done, and a door. Tin hill placement select. Making ourselves a door, nice. Noisy, noisy, noise, squish. Okay. Energy. You can skip this message by pressing enter. Energy is needed to have production running. Look at the core status panel. Energy indicator shows available points. So there's difference between input and output. If you have no power plants opened, energy will go down and balance will be negative. If enough power plants opened, energy will go up and balance will be positive. Okay. Every open module occupies a slot. Core slots show you the number of slots. Okay. How's that about? <clears throat> Close modules to save energy. Close them if not needed. Okay. So, what I gathered is we can shut that off. Turn that off. We can turn that off. Is that everything that's running? Good, that's off. Okay, I think everything's off. We shouldn't be draining any power. Okay, we have two available slots, I'm sure. No balance, no hull. Menu. How do we do this? Wait, more slots are now available. Uh, go to the storage module. Deploy storage module. When I had some of these. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, these these menus. I'm getting lost in them. So we're gonna go to storage. Deploy. Okay, let's. Maybe we should just keep the storage deployed? Okay, pick ship core from storage. I'm just following my quest menu up here in case anybody is wondering. And by anybody, I think 
me, Kyle, and Lat. Let's see. Take the ship core. Okay. You know what? I kind of feel like I should be taking all this. We took the breach repair kits. Take it, take it. Here, put all of that in there. There you go. Take all that goodness. Okay. Visit Captain for objectives. Wait, shouldn't I be placing this in here? I think it's just you. <laughs> it's okay. It's a new game. So we put these where? How do we utilize these? Da, 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 da. Upgrade increasing ship's energy and slot count after pacing into the drill ship's core upgrade. Um, yeah, so. So it already has a drill ship core? I don't know, let's go see, let's go see Capitan. He looks so serious. You fool, you lost your drill ship. Now we have to go through the procedure again. To get a new drill ship, you have to construct the ship engine. Get ship core upgrade to player inventory. Okay, we did that. Press in okay, that shows how to get to our menu. Go to the power module, deploy. Okay, deploy power, deploy refinery. Our refinery module. The other two are already deployed. Okay, we need some copper, but we have copper. What, we need 16 more of these bad boys? See, this is why I got extra copper. Dun, 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 ah. Okay, we got those. Now we need to go to, to production. What do we make at the work table? Storage, banners, ship core stats. All kinds of cool stuff. But that's the work table. We need the production. The production module. Get that bad boy working. Yo, what do we what do we what do we make in here? Some more bolts, tubes, and plates. So components. Bolts of bolts. We need three. Of plates, we need six. Wow. Yeah, the crafting is definitely going to take some getting used to in this game. One, two, three tubes. And then we're good. Dun, dun. Okay, we know about... Okay, slots. Yep, you told us that before. Do, 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 do. Close the refinery and the production module. Done. Full energy. Okay, pick ship core from storage. Wait, we did this. What the hell? Hasa house cat. Welcome to the stream stream. It's nice to see ya. Online. Okay, there's my ship core. Visit the captain for objectives. Claim drill ship. We have received a distress call of a heavily damaged drill ship that will soon surface close to our location. Use this to your advantage and claim the drill ship. Claim the drill ship by placing ship core upgrade. Okay. But the volcano is going to go off too. Well, I mean, if you're asking me, then you're actually cheating on Narcos with me. Squish, 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 squish. You know what? Maybe we can do it in three minutes. I wonder if we just straight up die if we're outside when the volcano erupts. Should we hang around outside and find out? Do, 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 do. 
there's just a drill ship hanging around. Oh, okay. Well, that's our shotgun. Oh, there's just the drill ship just kicking it here. Oh, who are you? Are you a threat to me? You don't seem to... Oh, God, this place is... This place tore up from the neck. Oh! How dare you raise a hand to me? Plotticus Nemicus. I? Well, I am good with that. All right, we got to put our... It's got a core. How do we do this? I said to put a drill ship thingy in there. Well, how might we go about doing that? Walk to the drill ship. Core is the rounded object on the wall. Okay, I'm assuming this is the core. Look at it. Press E. No, that's a radio. Uh, maybe it's not here. Maybe it's upstairs. Work table. Ah, there's the core. Oh shit! Volcano's erupting in a minute. Let's um, yeah, it's. Let's go back to hide. Well, maybe maybe it lasts for a few minutes. We'll check that out. We'll we'll go hide. We'll watch the volcano erupt. And as soon as it erupts, we'll go topside. Because maybe the ash does sit around for a little bit. I don't know. But again, this game is like... I think it said pre-alpha. So, you know, it's, it's got, a, got a road ahead of it. Come on. Come on. Good, good. There you go. There you go. We got a minute. Squish. Nuzzles. We got 30 seconds, Squish. And then a volcano is going to go skabloosh. Skabloosh. It's funny you mention that. That's kind of how I pictured the ending of Far Cry 5. You know, after the end of that game, you should have been able to explore the after effects. What do you mean a few shots? What are you at home taking vaccines for fun? <laughs> the land with bleakness I like how he says it's safe to go out now is it is it really we're not we're not gonna choke on ash there you go so yeah it, it looks like it does stay ashy there for a few minutes at least I guess this effect just wears off. It's kind of like a weather system. Appropriate music to go with the event, I think. We got the howling wind. We get the fire. Oh, you know what? I want to go look. I want to take a peek. Where is volume? Ooh, there's only like a main volume. I don't think that helped at all. <laughs> Ooh, that's that's hot. 
Ooh, well, you know, while we're here, might as well get us some shelf fare. Looks good to me. Let's get, let's get back to our drill thingy. Because the, the volcano clock, it's a ticking. Does it sound like lowering the volume in the game has made any difference? I I can't tell. I just want to know what the hell happened to this rig, man. It went down. I got up here before. How, how the hell did I do it? There we go. Wait, I don't even think this is... I don't think this is the right drill, because all the pieces are gone. No, I think that was... Uh-oh. Why do I need to talk to the captain? Okay, well I guess I'll go talk to the captain again. Again, pre-alpha, so you know we're gonna run in we're gonna run into some funky stuff. Next turn. No. I hope we don't have to do all that. Because we still have the core and everything. I don't know why we would, but you know. Yeah, go down. What, what's happening? What's going on, Captain? What's the scoop? Claim drill ship. I'm not sure how we lost the quest. Hopefully, everything will be lit up this time and we can actually claim it. This is an empty Pepsi. Just so the the two of you know, we'll be going back to Resident Resident Evil tomorrow. We're just taking a break tonight to check this game out. And then we'll return to our regularly scheduled program. Don't even think about it. Damn, he's got... Friggin' straight up ingots. I'll take that. Pikachu, 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 Chomp. Oh, you just gotta right click him. Alright, cool. I'm gonna figure out what the hell happened to this place. So that's the core. Push, what are we doing? Contact. Wait, 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 wait. Squish, what are you doing? You need at least one drill ship core. Whoa. Um. We had a drill ship quarter. What happened to it? Repair drill ship. The drill ship is heavily damaged. You have to fix it first before using it to its full potential. The drill ship can travel and hide underground, but unable to produce anything. Follow the instructions to fix the walls and place all required modules. Okay. Uh, fix a destroyed wall. Okay, for that we need our reach replacement. Let's put those in. How do we equip them? Put that in slot five. Maybe we just click five over it. Place left click. Oh, it just what auto does it for us? Da -da -da -da. Da, 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 da. Place the door module. Alright, I want my door. Da, 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 da. Eh, we'll put the door there. Place production module. Place it on the location on the fixed wall. Place it on the fixed wall. We are out of we are out of walls. Thought we had more repair kits. Me? Yeah, I don't know how we install this stuff. Bum, bum, 
The, my biggest issue with this game right now is just the the inventory in these things seems a little oh cool friggin five repair kits right there man and a module repair kit yeah a few of these seem a bit wonky okay so four how do I oh I'm using it okay Okay, reach replacement. So let's fix these. Okay, so we got to fix our wrench and fix those up. Okay. So let's push our refinery. And let's put our... Can we do... What does this look like from the outside? Oh, you can put these on the outside of your drill, too? I wonder, does it still do that? Oh. Oh. That's pretty cool. I think. Drill ship is now fully operational with production refinery systems running. You're capable to advance in the island exploration. Okay. So this, uh... Wait, what, what is this? That's a storage. Turn... Turn off. Shut that, shut that system down. Shut it down, Captain. Ooh, we still got some... Still got some hull damage, baby. How are we doing? Okay, good. Got our work table. Got our storage that it needs to be turned off. Our periscope. Turn that off. Okay, good. See, we're not draining power anymore. You gotta look at your balance. So we have no core slots. Yeah, I don't know how we do any of these. Like upgrades and whatnot. I'm sure it'll tell us eventually. Contact him through the radio. He's on the Mexican radio. Build power plant module. Before progressing any further, gather enough coal to fuel the drill ship systems. Power plants use coal to generate energy needed for all production, refinement, and research. Okay, place coal power plant T1 module on the ceiling of the drill ship. Sure. Okay, we gotta deploy our storage and our power. Wait, we saw power. Okay, deploy that. We saw power up here, didn't we? Yeah, there it is. Okay, we deployed our power on the ceiling. System has no energy. Go out and mine coal. Looks like energy's going up to me, man. Our balance is plus five. That's good. Maybe it took all of my coal just to refuel. Gotta remember where I put my door and crap. But I mean, it's pretty sweet. We got, we got a freaking drill ship. I'm definitely digging the look of this game. I I could see this game, if they really bring this through, being better than Ark. It's a super cool concept. So far, it's fun. The only issue I've had so far is just. Yeah, the UI is a little... Those inventory menus definitely need a little refinement. We want a lot of coal, baby. We want to be able to go where everybody knows our name. Good evening, Medros. Member and person of the stream. Nice to see you, sir. We're playing some Vulcanoids. It's a early access 
Free Alpha Steampunk Survival Game. We just mined ourselves some coal and we have acquired our very own drill ship. What we do with it, I'm not sure yet, but it's pretty cool. This is our mobile base of operations from what I understand. Do, 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 do. Seems to be somewhat operational-ish. How you doing, Midrosi? Place coal to drill ship. How do we do that? Do we put it in the active storage? Coal is used in power plants to generate energy. Make sure to have coal in opened storage modules. This will allow power plants to take the coal. Each time you hear a bell ring, it means the ship has no energy. Coal can always be found close to breaches of the island. Okay, cool. Well, let's keep our ship well powered. Let's put some sulfur in there too. You know what, let's put all of these materials in there. Depending on what to do for dinner, mm, we had chicken quesadillas, so throwing that out there. Ba, 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 da, da. Okay, deploy our power module, check. Deploy our production module, check. Ba, produce copper tubes and plates, why? Ba, 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 ba. Menu. Components. How many copper tubes do we need? Oh, just one and a plate. Produce power plant module. Okay, coal power plant. We have a research. Da, 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 da. Turrets, sweet. Refinery. So, power plant. It's cooking. Pick power plant module from storage. Okay, equip build tool. Look at the drill ship ceiling. Scroll mouse wheel until power plant appears and then place it. Sure. All right, build tool. Look at ceiling. Power plant, tier one. Boom. So we should have, so we had 200 energy before. So what did, what did adding a second one of these do? I figured our energy would have gone up. Hey, let's. Kill these storage, mo these modules here. It says to turn off excess modules when you're not using them. Our hull is nine of nine. So what? What is damaged? Can I do deconstructing? Okay, I guess I can't deconstruct that. Uh oh, volcano's getting close to erupting. Let's contact the Capitan. Build storage module. We are getting short on storage space. Are we? Make sure they are always opened to allow flow of items inside production lines. Okay, so we should have we should still have a storage module in storage right no I guess we gotta build another one da, 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 da. all right you know what we're gonna go with it Production. Let's activate our storage. Yeah, I could swear. So 
so we have object online let's make sure these are the, okay so that's it's the same thing just two different tabs I think so we want refinery no no trying to get a grasp on the crafting and everything in this game it's it's slightly it, it takes a little getting used to okay we deployed that oh we can go down and stuff now though so what is what does that do refinery station the only thing we do is there's ingot. We don't make our upgrades there. Oh, per right into the drill ship. Order to go underground. Go down, homie. Go down. Oh, that's freaking sweet. Hurry. It's gonna erupt. Okay, I gotta admit, that's pretty cool. I don't know where we're going. Where the hell are we going? My periscope, I think, is upstairs. Stay underground with the jewel ship until the eruption is over. Okay. Or if we just get further away. I mean, how much safer would it be underground during an eruption? You know what I mean? You figure that would just, like, crush your ship. Because when there's a huge eruption, that... That sends like tsunamis across the ocean. Thank you, Squish. <laughs> oh, that almost went down the wrong pipe. Order the drill ship to go to the surface. Okay. The surface. So, it put us somewhere else? I mean, that's pretty cool. That is awesome. All right, use the, let's see, travel to new location. Use the target selector to set new travel coordinates. Target selector. Okay. Set target two. Once selected, ensure the surface option is set. Pull the travel lever. Well, let's bug it. I wonder if it gives us like a sweet underground view. Ooh, Squish, where'd you go? Squish, come here. What are you doing? We'll get back up here. Like if it showed you tunneling, that'd be pretty freaking sweet too. Oh man. And it surfaces automatically for us too. Sweet. Okay, we have successfully traveled, I think. All right. We're going to make our storage module. We need to produce some copper bolts, plates, and tubes. Storage module. There we go. That takes uh, one copper plate, one tube, and one chest. Oh, okay. So one tube, one boat, two plates. So would a chest, would that be under? Module, equipment, chest. There we go, make one of those. Da, 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 da. 
Wait, where's it at? Storage module. Perfect. Perfect mundo. Hey, squish. Okay. We've done it. Now we just gotta get it out of storage. Which we can also access from here. I figure, I think once I get the hang of these freaking menus, then I'll be alright. Okay, a quick build tool. Look at the ceiling. What if I what if I don't want to put a storage module on the ceiling? I'm kinda running out of room on the ceiling for storage. But it's done. What's done is done. Let's deactivate some of this crap, man. Wait, balance is still going down. Shut it down, shut it all down. All right, Captain Stubing. Install drill ship segment. The drill ship is getting short on space. Produce and install the segment upgrade to make the drill ship longer. Okay, cool. I'm all about having a bigger drill, but um, what are we making? What are we making? Deploy the storage module, the production and the power. We need boats, copper, so much copper. Tubes, plates. Boats. Manufacture the segment upgrade. Hmm. Hi, Stormy. Welcome to the stream, dear. Drill ship segment. Tis done. We're playing some Vulcanoids tonight, Stormy. Just taking a break for a day from Resident Evil 5. We'll be back at RE5. No. <laughs> RE2. Tomorrow. And hopefully we'll at least finish the Claire playthrough tomorrow. I, I feel like we're getting toward the end of the playthrough. For the Claire at least. And then we could do Leon. Uh, we'll see what finishing a campaign opens up for us. Alright. Take it from storage. Badoosh. The drill ship must go underground for segment installation. Why is that? That seems odd. Oh shit! You friggin' fruitcake, how damn diggity dare you. Yeah, I know, Squish. They don't know what the hell just hit them. I like that the enemies drop repair modules. That's friggin' sweet. A periscope. That robot was running around with a damn periscope in his pocket. So yeah, this is the game, Stormy. It's it's a steampunk survival game. It's pretty awesome. Thanks for being a patron. <laughs> so this game was 20. So I have it in the budget to get a game. You know, a normal full price $59.99 game. So since this was 20, I'm also going to get Genesis Alpha 1 that lat recommended it looks pretty interesting so we're gonna get we're gonna play this Genesis Alpha 1 Resident Evil 5 and then the eighth we're gonna transition to God Eater which I'm going to use uh, Streamlabs donations for and then we will we'll be on track and my fingers are crossed I, pl I played the demo for God, the new God Eater, and it seemed like it was different enough from God Eater 2. So, um, it's been kind of, how can I compare this? It's been kind of like a Dynasty Warriors type thing, where the new games really don't offer anything new. You know what I mean? So, like, if you played the first God Eater, you basically played the second God Eater. Kind of like that. So the third one looks like it's different enough that I think we'll be safe. Okay, we need to go underground for segment installation. So yeah, Stormy, that, that's our mobile base right there. We just claimed it, repaired it, and now it's ours. Pretty sweet. And this game is in pre-alpha. 
So, you know, we're expecting some bugs, some glitches, some audio funky stuff going on. But honestly, so far, all we've had happen is kind of just a, a quest reset on us. But that's it. Okay, wait until it reaches the underground and stops. Go to the core stats panel and click the menu. Core stats, okay. Click the segment upgrade. And then install it. Okay. I don't know why it showed us the surface. <clears throat> Wait, did, did we surface? So, this is a very cool concept. I am thoroughly enjoying this game so far. My only issue is just the inventory and menus are a little confusing. But outside that, oh, check that out. Our base is freaking bigger now. Okay, that's cool as hell. That's so cool, Squish. All right, Captain Stubing, what's our next quest? Build a turret module. Once you travel further, there's a high risk cogs will try to destroy your drill ship. Make sure you can defend it by building a turret module. Once the turret's deployed, it automatically shoots at enemy units. Always make sure there's available turret ammo and online cargo. Stormy, you're gonna start, <laughs> you're gonna start the night off like that, Stormy? Come on. When one of these days you need to roll in, hit that first roll with a hundred like Kyle did yesterday, and it'll be good. All right, sir, refined sulfur. Sulfur powder. Okay, how much? Two of it. Okay. Now we need the standard stuff. Bolts, plates, and tubes. Block. Block. Buck, 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 buck. And some tubes. All right, produce turret ammo. Wait, shouldn't I make the turret first? Ba, 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 ha. Turret ammo. Done, done, and diggity done. Oh, now it's telling us. Now we gotta make the module. There we go. Turret. <laughs> Stormy spin coming right up. Bigger bam. There you go, Tia. Ah, three Hondo Squish Airs. Guys, tonight is the last night of double values for the Squish Wheel. Tomorrow, they revert back to the normal values because remember, they've been doubled the whole month of January. So if you're a patron or a stream member, make sure you get those rolls in tonight. <laughs> All right, where do we want to put a turret? Where's the new segment of our... Oh. Oh, that's cool as hell, man. Can we put it... It says use the mouse wheel. Okay, the mouse wheel isn't doing anything. <laughs> yeah, mouse wheel is not doing anything. Okay, that is not functioning. <laughs> Let's put away this periscope then. Maybe that will help us. Maybe if we pop that bad boy in storage, we won't have to worry about it. Look at the drill ship side wall. Okay. What if I want to put it on the roof? Oh, it won't let me. Cool. My freaking turret, man. Sweetness. Okay, our ammo's in there too. Sweet. Let's contact Captain Stubing. Prepare for attack! Before we can start the attack at first lava source, we have to produce equipment to stand the chance against enemy defenses. Produce grenades, medkits, and ammo, and take them with you on the next quest. Okay, we got we got shotgun slugs, medkits, we just need grenades. 
squish, 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 squish. Oh man, we gotta make 14 of these bastards. Thank you guys so much for coming out and watching tonight. As always, me and the squishies appreciate it. I know we're we're taking a gamble playing a an off the wall game here, but that's okay. I'm enjoying it, and I hope you guys watching are enjoying it. We're just taking a we're just taking a one day break from Resident Evil 2, and we'll get back to it tomorrow. Okay. Wait, why do I need to equip my pickaxe and gather materials? Are we truly out of copper? I feel like we should have plenty. Hi, Squishy. Go into my some copper. This game has a ridiculous amount of freaking potential. It's crazy. I saw enemies. Right, we got sulfur. We got a bunch of copper nodes. Oh, that is cooking my brain. No, thank you. Pass on that. Ooh, is that gold? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Nope, 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 nope. That's fine. Oh, volcanoes. We got three minutes to the volcano. I don't see any coal around this area. Much to my dismay. I'm pretty sure we're going to need it at some point. That's squishy. Unless this counts as coal. No. No. Let's shoot us some freaking innocence. Oh, right, right in the power source in the back. I am a banner. Some nuts and bolts and screws. You done so? Oh, oh you want to play that? One? Get that leg. Ugh. A production. <laughs> Man, these things just drop like everything you need. You might not actually have to make anything in this game. You just loot it from these clowns. Yeah, I see copper plates, all kinds of shizzles. Everything you need to succeed. That was that noise. Two minutes until volcano eruption squish. Let's go. Why do I hear an engine running back here? Y'all hear that too? Or am I tripping? Oh, uh, you done, son. A long distance radio. We already have one, so I don't know why I took another one. I hope my turret took care of that one that was running toward my ship. Energy low. Open coal power module and... Uh, we haven't found any any coal around here. Well, damn. Put, okay, okay, we need to put the materials in storage. Well, put that sulfur in there too. Good. Volcano's about to erupt. We're going to go underground here soon. Okay, we're gaining energy. That's good. Uh, let's turn some things off. Okay, we're gaining three energy. It's even better. Wonderful. Gain from turning that off. Uh oh. Oh dear. Time to bob with a twang to bang to bang get the hell out of here. Pack it up, boys! We're going underground! We're going underground, Squish. No more nonsense. I got the achievement Robot Killer. Oddly. 
while I was in my ship not killing robots. Let's go check out our periscope. Let's see what's going on up there. Oh, <laughs> we went underground just in time, didn't we? Squish, 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 squish. Oh yeah, we're supposed to be making grenades, aren't we? Oh, the blast destroyed everything. That's okay. We're alive. That's all that matters. Thank you, squish. Upward we go, squish. How often does the volcano blow? There's a timer at the very top up there that tells us. It looks like it uh, every 18 minutes. I don't know if that value varies, but it seems like it's been 18 minutes fairly consistently. No. 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 It might also depend on what area we're in. We're in area two, I think. It's kind of hard to tell where we're at. Um, maybe we're here because that's where the icons at but that's area one it says we're in location two wait we're in location two okay so that is where we're at so let's uh, we need coal soil sandstone granite um, none of these say coal it's interesting Da, 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 da. Refinery tech, research tech, production tech. All right, we're gonna stick to what we're doing first. Da, 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 da. Just make some grenades. Deploy the refinery in the storage. Ha swag! Welcome to the stream, swaggerty. What's up? Is that the refinery? Uh, Refine copper. And I think we do that from production. No, we do that over here at the refinery station. Wait, we shouldn't need to do that. We got, oh, we have less copper than I thought we did. Okay, we'll make some copper. Okay, now we need the bolts, the plates, and the tubes. The beeps, the blips, and the jips. One, two, three. Alright, a bolt and some plates. Okay, we need five grenades, two med kits, and some shotgun ammo nishin. I'm thinking we do from up here at the work table. Consumables, tools, grenade, item missing. What are we missing? Um, huh. Yeah, the bleeps, the sweeps, and the creeps. <laughs> Only one man would dare give me the raspberry. Lone Star. Oh. Okay, I need to check my friggin' storage because I can swear. Okay, why is it why is it telling me we don't have the things we need for a grenade? Okay, that's that's active, so it should be reading it. Copper tubes, zero available. Do I have to put them in the workbench? I thought having them in storage activated them everywhere. Okay, let's let's just try this. 
Oh, now I did it. Storage, got three grenades. Oh, my inventory's full. Uh, character. God, these menus, I swear. Okay, two of those. I need... Actually, I think all we need was the grenades. Wait, wait, wait. Module repair kit. Let's put those away. I have a lot of extra crap. You know what? A banner. I want to use that. We don't need another radio. We have another production module. Okay, let's deactivate this crap. Because if we leave it active, it, it's a power drain. So we want our energy to hold up as much as possible. Deactivate Lava Shosh. It's time to let the cogs know they are not alone in this island anymore. Travel to the lava cave and destroy the laser drill ship. This is getting intense real fast. Make sure you brought enough grenades to take it out quickly. Destroy all modules at the base of the crane and it will collapse. Time the attacks well or your effort will be wasted if you have to withdraw because of an incoming eruption. Well, we got 12 minutes. Okay, so we want to do lava source one. So we need to go to area or 10, I think. Maybe 10, 10 or 11. So location two, target 10. Let's go. I like this game too. It's, it's definitely a very awesome concept. There's a lot of things here I haven't seen done before, like our mobile base. I, I can't think of any survival games that give you a mobile base to this effect. So that's pretty freaking awesome. Oh, the drilling underground to travel. That's freaking sweet. I think once they evolve this game a bit more, clean up the menus and whatnot, I think it'll be pretty fantastic. Yeah, the thing we're in right now is our mobile base. Th this is our base of operations, the drill. What about Subnautica? I mean, you could have a house. I don't know. I don't know if the ship in that really serves the same purpose. Oh, dear. What am I looking at? I don't know. I, I guess you could count the Cyclops. Bah, 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 bah. Oh. Come on, where my turret at? Return fire, scrub Oh, uh, that shit's active. Act Alright, let's... Who that shoot me? I got grenades, and I am only partially scared to use the damn things. Get off my ship, home skillet. We got nothing, nothing. Boom, boom, boom. Destroy all modules at the base of the crane. Use grenades to destroy them quickly. Okay. Do 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 do. And again, this game is pretty alpha, so it has a long road ahead of it. And I am very eager to see where they go with this game. Okay, that's pretty cool. A quick draw, give me draw, homie. A banner large. I like looting these things. They always have such interesting. I think we loot every item in this game from these guys. Destroy. What? A... See, I'm not sure what I'm throwing my grenade at. Like, am I just throwing it in this vicinity? Okay. 
Can I wreck it with gunfire? And if the little robots can... Am I out of ammo? <laughs> I am. Shit. <laughs> Whoopsie poopsie. Da -da 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 Let's go see about making some more freaking grenades then, huh? Guess that's nothing. Oh, it says destroy all modules at the base of the crane. Okay. I'm not entirely certain what that means. No more copper bolts. Let's make some no more copper ingots. Are you serious? I got copper friggin' I got pipes, bolts, I got whatever you need, man. Just make this shiz. Okay, we got slugs. We got some grenades. Let's go back and see what's up. I gotta find what they mean by modules. Alright, there's another module. But where's the module? You know what I mean? Like, there's two destroyed. There's two destroyed. I don't know what the final module would look like. That? Oh! I died. Well, okay. Didn't quite realize I was getting shot at. Maybe that's what the gunfire sound was, huh? Aha! Sure as you are, scrubs. I don't want any of that. Ripperoni. Rest in pepperonis. Alright. So what if we just fire there, huh? Okay, so that's a module. That's a module. These are modules. Bagoon, Bagoon, Bahama. And that's a module, but we're out of grenades. <laughs> I hope I can take this thing out with gunfire. Otherwise, we're gonna need a lot of grenades. Oh, of course, it put me put me at the point before I made all my ammo. Okay, note to self. We should have came here with a lot more grenades. Like 18 grenades or more. Is this coal? Because that would be great. My ship is eventually going to need some coal. That is nothing. Damn it. Well, at least I'm getting the hang of it. More or less. <laughs> Make some of that, make some of that. Module not available. What a key main module not available. Oh, energy's low. Module not opened. Oh, well. Excuse the fork out of me? Dun, 
What's this thing doing? Um. Okay. Scissors two there. What the hell? Only partially confused as to what's going on at the moment. Alright, what about our Helter Schmelter? Um, okay. Let's freaking put you away then. Damn. I have no idea what's going on at the moment. <laughs> Tools. Nades. Alright, made a little bit. Let's use this med kit. Heal ourselves up a wee bit, squish. No. I knew. Oh, that made us five grenades. Sweet. I need to see if I can destroy these modules just by shooting at it. If not, we're definitely going to have to surface and go after more materials. Come on, destroy that bad boy. Ah, cool, we can. Um, how do we get to... The others. Maybe a little fancy footwork, eh? Uh, well, we got four and a half minutes to figure it out. And then we're gonna have to bug out because the volcano is gonna erupt. I will definitely take some of that because we need this for grenades, I think. Get it, baby. Ah, oh, inventory full. Crap. We got five grenades and six modules. Come on. Just get over to it. And devastate it, please. Ooh. Ah, oh, the myth. It's a hit. Oh, it's a turret. Shit. Got him. Got him. Got him. Pew pew. Pew pew. Ouch. Ow. Heal, baby. Okay, good. The laser drill ship is packed and hidden. Wait until the eruption head happens and attack again. Oh. Well, that was... Sucked and was cool at the same time. Is there a better way for me to get back to my ship? No. So we better higgity higgity haul ass. Wait, is that my ship? That ain't my ship, is it? No, that ain't my ship. Can I take it as my ship? Ooh. A few enemies here. Oh, there's a turret. Oh, crap. That is definitely the enemy gunship. Oh, shit. Cover to cover, baby. Cover to cover. Oh, oh. I, I'm plinking like I'm made out of metal too, so 
My character may also be a robot. Ooh, just run from the turret, okay? Oh shit, I don't think we're gonna make it. I do not think we're gonna make it in time. Can I walk and heal at the same time? That's good. Dun, 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 dun. Ah, freaking full inventory. Oh, this is gonna be close. Oh shit! We got a minute to get to our ship and dive. Come on, freaking stamina! Oh, oh, oh little, little squish. Come on, squish. You're supposed to be good luck. Help me! Help me! Perizes! Alright, we're there. Dive, dive, dive! Oh, I'm mad at Squish. I think we just need to go to the surface, supply up, come back down with Buku grenades, and go to town. Alright, we are safely under the earth. And safely being a matter of perception. Storage. Wait, there's gonna be an underground eruption too? Does is this gonna look different than the surface? Because that would be pretty awesome. Oh shit. <laughs> yes. We would have been cooked. We would have been made into crispy bacon. We definitely would have been crispy critter, eh? <laughs> Look at Captain Stubing up there. He's like, oh, the, the eruption's over. It's safe to go outside. Are you sure? Because I just... I have a notion it's probably still 5,000 degrees under there. Just a hunch. Okay, everything's off. Let's travel. Let's go to point. Let's go to point nine because no reason. We'll surface up and see what's up. Oh, it's such a chill tune. I love it so much. I wonder if you can use your periscope while traveling. Dun, 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 dun. Sort of? This game is awesome. I am eagerly awaiting for this game to evolve a bit. You know what? I should install another door here. Ooh, inventory space is kind of a premium here. Low energy. Um, that means we're going to need some coal? Ooh, we're totally out of energy. No wait, we have coal. Maybe we just have to activate that? Okay, cool. There we yeah, there we go. It's cranking up the energy. It's cooking that coal, baby. I gotta admit, once you once you get used to the menus, it does get easier. It's just I think if they diversified the crafting things a bit more, it would be helpful. You know what I mean? Because with it all being the same color, like the refinery station and the production station, granted it's got a blue top and a red top, but they're, they're too similar. You know what I mean? 
Like, they just... They seem like they should look a lot different than what they do. So if we activate that, does this mean we can use it outside? Or does that just mean we activated it? Either way, it's pretty freaking cool. Alright. Storage. Let's pick a storage bin. You know what? Let's just put shit in a wall locker. How about freaking that? Uh, Bind the... Store grenades. Keep our shells. Storage here. We want all of this goodness. Yeah, things like this we should put in the chest, not... Not in here, really. Actually, give those back. Oh! Who diggity dares? You diggity dare. Get out of here, cog. You're just a cog in a bigger picture. Oh, I thought I was hoping I could make that long shot. I could not. Used in scrap station to obtain copper ingot. I don't think we have a scrap station. Son of a bitch, you're shooting my modules. See that shit, Cal? Sun guns was shooting my modules. Don't nobody shoot my modules. How do we repair it? Can we repair it? I forget how you use this. Oh, it says for repairing destroyed. Maybe we can't repair things before they're destroyed. That'd be kind of odd, wouldn't it? Oh good, the wind stopped. Module not opened. Is this the refinery? No material. How do you mean no material? See, sometimes I don't understand why things say they're not available. Hi, Mr. Moa. How you doing, sir? It's nice to see you, my friend. Yeah, let's make this all the sulfur ore. Okay, so that tells me we should be able to make some copper. Pretty good, man. We're playing. We're checking out Vulcanoids. It's a, a steampunk themed survival game, and it's pretty awesome. Hockey, you you can't sleep. Oh, so you just lurk in my stream, expecting the voice to put you to sleep? Is that what it is? You just lay your cheeks down on the pillow, listen to the sweet melodies on the soundtrack, and let the soothness just drift you to slumberland. <laughs> we have a lot of sulfur. Like a ton. See, I don't know why it will pull the sulfur powder from another storage unit. But it's telling me we're out of everything else. It's kind of weird. Dun, dun. It's out of exploding volcanoes. What? There's none of that here. I don't know that my turret is actually keeping me safe. Maybe it's out of ammo. Okay, that storage has nothing. Okay, that's one storage unit. So I really only have a storage unit. I got it. I think. I take a tank. My epic creator code yet for Subnautica. Um, no. How does one go about getting one of them? And hello, Solitaire. Member of the stream, it's fantastic to see you. We're playing a little 
Volcanoid. Yeah, that's it. It's a steampunk-based survival game. So we have our mobile base of operations. It's pretty sweet. We gotta get rid of these chump changes. A ship core stats. Nope, I don't need that. I will take the plates though. What was I here to mine? Actually, you know what? We'll put we'll put copper items in here, and then we'll activate that storage, and we should be able to do everything we need in the work table. Hey, boy, Wanka! Cut it out! Some bitches! I just wrecked. They sunk my battleship. Wait, that wasn't my door, was it? That was my damn door. I don't want to make a wall. I'm going to make another damn door. Or I can't get out to my freaking ship. Hey, that's some shit. But I got to remember how the hell we make it. I'm guessing the production. Okay, so let's activate... Our production station. Our storage is active. Okay. Module. Door. Uh, what do you mean item missing? Copper tubes and plates. We have that in storage. Hmm. Snog is on Epic Store, so gifts can be given via that game. Huh. Oh, there we go. Okay, it's making it. Excellent. Cool. Moe excellente. We need some freaking copper. We need some freaking... Actually, I don't think we need any coal. Yeah, Solitaire. This is an early access game. 20 bucks. Pre-alpha, you know, as most early access games go. But very interesting design and concept. I am very eager to follow this game. This and Hellsign. I am I really want to see what's next for Hellsign too. I love me some Hellsign. I just I really have a thing for games that just have such a big wide open canvas. And the devs can just do whatever they want, you know? And I'm curious to see where that goes. Especially with it being steampunk themed. You know, is, is our mobile drill base going to be the only thing we can really build? Or as the game develops, you know, are we going to... Is it going to go the road of like Ark and Atlas and we'll be able to just build wherever we want? I don't know, but I am so curious. Because right now, all we got really to our name is a shotgun, a pickaxe, and a and a freaking pipe wrench. <laughs> That's it. What was I making? I was making. You know what? What do we need for grenades? It's kind of the main thing we need to be cooking up. Grenades! Take tubes, plates, and powders. Why does it keep telling me zero available? There's a stack of 20 copper right there. I guess I have to have it in my inventory? So tubes and plates. Oh, cheeky bastards. Y'all need to give it a friggin' rest, man. I'm just trying to get some work done. I'm just trying to make... I'm just in here making grenades so I can go destroy your underground lab. And you bastards won't let me be. Give it up. Do, do, 
Now let's put this back in storage. Crap, what was it making? Tools, grenades. Grenade, grenade, grenade. Tubes and plates. Plates and tubes and plates and tubes and plates and tubes and grenades. Okay, that's five grenades. Excellent. We'll st we'll stock these for now. No, we won't. Okay, I guess we won't. Let's take it. Actually. Our turret has proved to be particularly useless in this endeavor. We're still, we're gonna activate it at least. See, I feel like maybe we're supposed to activate these two as well. Then again, maybe not. Maybe we just need a, a turret on the other side as well. Plates. Plates, plates, plates. This is a good way to get rid of our freaking copper, too. As many grenades as we can freaking make. Are we seriously out of sulfur powder? No, we're not. Definitely got plenty of that. Four grenades. Good. So we need 18 grenades. At least for this endeavor. Because there were three cranes we got to destroy. And each of the three cranes has six modules that we got to bust up. Uh. So, well, he has been drinking just a little bit there, Lat. So, I think he's off his game a bit. Plates. Wait, what? Tubes. Apparently your workbench is the only module that doesn't pull from storage. Like I said, the, the inventory and getting around the menus definitely, it, it takes some getting used to. Let's go refine all this copper. Uh, we got two minutes till the volcano goes skabloosh. See, it says we have no copper ore. But if we put it in here, it should tell us we have copper. Yes. Ba, ba, ba. Why is the module not available? Refine for me, baby. Oh, son of a... Son of a biscuit maker. Get... Take that shot to the face. Brass monkey. Oh, we missed. Give you a double shot of love and so fine, girl. <laughs> I love you cause you do such a wild girl like a double shot of love and so fine. <laughs> I, could, I could be a cover band for Aerosmith. If that was Aerosmith. <laughs> Make them coppers for me. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Bok, bok, bok. Volcano's about to blur. Oh, I've, oh, no. I didn't mean to attack my own drill ship. Look, just go down. <laughs> if you shoot your own ship, it sets off the alarm. <laughs> My bad. Sorry about that. I squish it. All right, let's get to the periscope. Let's see what's going down. 
I kind of hope they add some variety to this when the eruption goes off, like s more enemy types and whatnot. Like sometimes when the volcano erupts, I don't like magma demons and stuff to spew out of there. That'd be freaking sweet. Steampunk magma demons at that. T-1000s and shit. <laughs> And the land was covered once more with ash. And we rose from our ashy grave and proceeded. You know, I wonder if these, not the breach replacements, but there's, there's also repair kits that I think are all on the freaking submarine. You know what? I think if we go back to area one, maybe. Sorry. Sorry, my bad. That was my second desk pop today. <laughs> squish, 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 squish. Squish, squish. Oh. That's right, like a phoenix. Buck, buck. Let's see if I can do. Ooh. Ooh, I don't know about coming up right by this magma. Wait, this is the first area. No, we'll be okay. Let's see. Let's see if this works. Let's put me over me. Wait, wait, that's not right. Wait! No! What have you done? What have I done? Done. Let's go down, down, down. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh my god, it is 947, isn't it? Okay, let's. Let's do the infinity squish. Oh, there we go. Oh. Just in case you hadn't had enough to drink there, Sir House Cat dude. Squish. Squish. <laughs> Wait, what happens if I put this above my cam? Oh, no, no, that's, that's bad. What if I can do this too? That's not working. Oh, that's working. You're not that drunk, are you sure? Oh, here we go. We're playing with all kinds of stuff here. What if I did this big? Screen? Oh shit, that's. It's your map, fucking vortex, you awesome. Yeah! <laughs> this is how you play with chroma key. Clearly, I have lost my mind. <laughs> oh dear. What do these do? Anything? Oh. Let's reset. Reset! Reset. Enough with the funky colors. But here's where I can... We should play a black and white game one day. And just be like, oh, it's so solemn. I don't know what to do. It's a 70s Black Sabbath video. Uh, squish. <laughs> oh, that's good stuff. That's enough of that. Wave heads are fun. But, oh my god, yeah, that's 950. Let's see here. Ooh, we got seven people. Oh, well, let's see. Let's see if we have anybody to raid, and then we'll determine if we have enough people to raid. Let's see. 
Yeah. Yeah, so how about a last minute squish wheel? For you, of course. Ba -da 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 -da. Let's do some squishy wheels. Ba -ba 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 300 squish hairs. There's one for Madros. And there's 400. Nice. So let's see. Mr. Moore's down for a raid. I'm down for a raid. Salatea's down for a raid. But I don't have anybody in particular on to raid. So, moderators, if you have someone in mind, first one to speak up gets the slot and we'll go raid them. Uh, as always, thank you beautiful people for being here. Me and Squish greatly appreciate it. We love all of our patrons, members, donators, moderators, and viewers. So basically, if you're here, we freaking love you. There's only a special privilege thrown out, you know, here or there. But yeah, mods, if you guys have anybody on that you would like to raid, that we haven't raided in a bit, Go ahead and uh, drop it. There we go. Sir House Cat has a link for you guys. Me and Squish are going to shut down here, and we will see you again tomorrow as we continue Resident Evil 2. Click that link and hit him with a hashtag NeoRaid.